Hello friends, let's start today splash screen in Android Studio. So first of all, how to create splash screen in Android Studio. So first of all, go to in Android Studio. So here is the my splash screen. So first of all, splash screen uh, prepared by Rana Panchal and progress bar. Here is the progress bar. This is the coding uh, tax view tax view tax is a splash screen and 30 dp it is the size of uh, screen uh, we would change 25 dp okay so it is just 25 so here is the run of punch chart prepared by so we can change something so now it is a tax view now it is a progress bar progress bar is it's it's a uh, progress one slowly it is a progress bar so now first of all we take right click and take flash screen go to java and take flash screen so flash screen have certain coding private progress bar m progress on create and flash screen activity is the uh, here is a splash screen. It is a layout and it is a class. So layout is called it is here. Splash screen is layout is called here. M progress bar. Progress bar find view by ID R dot class screen. So inside the class screen uh, it is the ID of class screen. This is the ID. It can fall over here and now start length. Then the operation in background thread, a new thread, new runnable public void train, do work, do work is uh, here, and start app, start app is uh, here, and finish. So, uh, progress bar that is uh, progress 0 to 100, thread dot slip, 1 minute, and 1000, zero, zero, zero. and progress dot stack progress, progress, there is a progress. Then cache print stack if you get any error and any occurrence. Then when progress bar is completed, then activity is navigate to last screen to main activity. It is a uh, navigate to last screen to main activity. Uh, then suppose we want to create last screen and last screen is our first activity. So here is we can change and put it is a main activity then so start class print then open main activity second activity is a this one so class print first activity is a class print then open second activity this one so here is the now coding part is here do I class print uh, trade runnable public wide run do work start app start app it is a function and inside the function intent new intent class dot this main activity dot class start activity intent so then navigate to another page okay this is this last one video and um, here is register class in class java class so now run this application so start now we can see class screen inside my java class so gradle is built running portion and here is the class screen coding if you want to see and if you want to run now installing apk file then open here my apk file is installed inside the my emulator it is my emulator my all screen is display over here now class screen is running i class screen is running progress bar is okay now i would like to run again 
here is my activity my activity is running from my application flash screen demo prepared by runner this progress bar is uh, increase slowly slowly so you can see my demo flash screen now navigate to another one so thank you for watching this video so subscribe please my video so thank you for watching thank you